Hello Internet, this is the one and only coming to you with another video tutorial on this time it's on how do you print double sided with your HP 6500 E710A. Um, so to my surprise when I bought this printer on Black Friday it did not have manual double sided printing. I actually thought it was going to come with a duplexer. Turns out HP 6500 Plus is the one that comes with the, du the full auto duplexer and has uh, the driver provisions to do double sided printing. Um, why they didn't put in manual driver uh, to you know manually double sided print on this printer I have no idea. But anyway so here's how you uh, double sided print with the HP 6500 E710A. So you can do it manually but uh, I'll let you figure out how to do that um, or I'll post it in the comments if you ask. Uh, but here's how you do it automatically with using a driver, which is I think what you're looking for. You go to start, go your devices and printers if you have it, control panel if you don't, devices and printers. Um, this is what it should look like roughly. Um, this is just after you follow the standard installations instructions from HP, um, either you know installing the stuff from the CD or getting the drivers downloaded from the internet and installing them there. So you just follow those instructions, you install your printer, and it should have something like this. Actually, it will probably um, should be set to, to that. Um, okay, so this is what you want to do next. Right click, go to Printer Properties, select the Offset Printer one, not the fax, the printer. Um, look at the ports. Uh, mine's attached to USB 002 because it's attached via USB. Um, if you're attached via a uh, network, then you then this might I don't know I haven't tried it, but you should still be able to see what port you're using on the network. Um, okay, so then what you want to do? Add printer. Uh, if you're on network, you'll probably have to use this button. Uh, since I'm using USB, add local printer. Select the port that you are uh, attached to. So USB 002 for me. Click next. Go find HP in this uh, manufacturer box here, and then in the printer's box, you want to highlight HP Offset Pro K55 series. If this is not in your boxes, go ahead and click Windows Update, um, and it should populate into there. Um, this is Windows 7 64-bit. I have not tried this in Windows Vista or Windows 7 32-bit, but it should work on both of those, uh, or all of those operating systems. I am not sure how you do this on Windows XP, but um, I'm sure it's possible. You just got to find this driver somewhere. I don't know where you'd find it. So you'd have to do some uh, internet searching to find that driver. You're going to click next. This will just install your printer for me since I already have it installed. Uh, I'm not going to go any further. Come back to this screen. Go ahead and click refresh. Right click and go to printer Pro properties. You should see this HP Offset Pro K55 series installed now. You'll go ahead and click on that uh, and print the test page. If it works, then you're all set up so far, and you can move on to the next step. If it doesn't, then you need to go back and troubleshoot it until it does work. So and then to make it the default printer, just go ahead and set it as the default printer. <coughs> right click, of course, set as default, and then click it. Uh, if you refresh the page, you'll no longer see that pretty icon. But hey, now you've got double-sided printing. You can set your printer preferences uh, by going to Printing Preferences and clicking on the Offset Pro K55 series printing. You'll notice that this one has nice boxes, a lot of tabs at the top, you know, what you'd expect from a new printer. Um, you also notice under the Finishing tab, it has the Print on Both Sides Manually option, which is what we're looking for in this tutorial. So thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you like it, please like and favor it. Uh, if you want to see more tutorials like this one, please subscribe to my channel. And until next time, this is the one and only signing off.